Tartan Tog. I'm Jennifer Marks, Editor-in-Chief of Home and Textiles Today. And I'm Warren Schulberg. And happy 2015. We're here at Heim Textile, of course. And people are hammering and sawing and drilling and pulling fabrics out of boxes and steaming them, which means... It's setup day. It is setup day here. And we thought that we might start off by kind of talking about the environment in which everybody's getting ready to start having their meetings this week. And I think you've got like a perfect economic storm for the textile industry, but also for Americans. Okay. You've got low cost cotton, you've got low prices on oil, so yep. that's good for, for synthetics. Right. You've got a good Christmas season. Looks uh, like. For American stores. Yes. You've got um, uh, the economy here in Europe's a little softer, which means American customers are more attractive to Asian suppliers. Yeah, yeah. And you've got among the best uh, uh, currency exchange rates for the U.S. dollar we've seen in a long time. Long time. So good business conditions, yeah, I think. Yeah, yeah, definitely. And, and back home? Back home, I think a couple of interesting things. The fast fashion retailers starting to move into the home space in the United States. Okay. As you know, the internationally, a lot of them are there already. So we had recently had Zara saying that they're going to start to roll out home to all of their apparel stores around the world, including the United States. We have Anthropology saying that they're going to cut their uh, their apparel from 71% to 53% to make more space for home. And you got to think H&M can't be far behind. Gotcha, yep. The other thing would be the idea of re retailers using some of their stores as de facto distribution centers for online ordering. We're gonna see where that goes. Lots going on. Lots going on, as always. Okay, so we're gonna be here all week with our videos. That we are, and if you're here at the show, please stop by our booth in the Galleria, pick up an issue, say hi. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.